What's going on guys, GC Random Videos here and today this is not a tutorial. This is a video on just telling you the pros and cons of doing YouTube. So somebody had asked me Tech Shock, what are the pros and cons of doing YouTube? Like what do you get out of it and what don't you get out of it? Like what do you lose from it? Well I can tell you one thing that what you lose is sleep. <laughs> Let's get into the video. So Pros and cons of YouTube. There are a lot of pros and a lot of cons, but some way out the other. Sorry for my hair; it's all messy. I gotta go get a haircut and like gel it up. So yeah, um, yeah. Hope you guys like this video. Yeah, Christmas is over here. Two days away. Two days away. I'm hoping I get a new microphone. I'm down praying. And the camera I asked for, which is badass. So yeah, the pros and cons of YouTube. Well, some of the pros are you get to learn a lot of new things. Like before I started YouTube, I barely knew anything about computers. I started YouTube in like well, actually, I did know stuff about computers. But like when I started YouTube, when I started to YouTube, I started to be more the better genius with that. Um, Photoshop, I like snapped on the Photoshop this quick, like a pro. I mean, I was doing it before that, but like I got better video editing, content creation, Adobe Illustrator, um, sound editing, sound editing. Those are some quick things that are are good. Some cons are you have to stay on top of your grades. I mean, you should be doing that anyways. But you gotta stay on top of your grades because you can't be failing. And I mean, unless your parents let you, my parents don't. You have to be passing to do YouTube. So, yeah. And it kind of makes you look forward. Another con is that at, by, you get that feeling when somebody says, Hey, I enjoyed your video. Thanks, man. This really helped me. Like, I just get this feeling like I helped someone. You know what I mean? So yeah, that's a that's another reason why I still create videos. I've thought about a couple times not creating videos, but I still want to just for you guys. So yeah. Um, what else? Things just like a con would be the equipment having to buy equipment now you don't have to spend a lot for equipment but you know you have to spend something if you want to make quality videos if you're gonna make like desktop tutorials all you really need is your laptop or a desktop and bandicam or action or whatever and maybe a simple webcam with a microphone that's it but if you're gonna be maybe a tutorial, you might want to get like a better camera. I mean, you could use your phone. The phones are pretty good. The Galaxy S6 Edge Plus, the Note 5, those are good for cameras. But just think about it. Um, if you're gonna be a gaming, you're gonna have to spend like 130 something on an Elgato. If you want the HD60, you're gonna have to spend like what, almost 200 dollars. Yeah. If you're gonna do PC gaming, you gotta have a kick ass PC with like, I don't know, a Core i5, at least 3 gigabytes of GTK 5 VRAM, you know, 16 gigabytes of memory for your editing and for running multiple tasks and things like that. So, all in all, YouTube is really fun. I mean, those cons don't really matter to me. Yeah, but I enjoy YouTube. Hope you guys enjoy YouTube. This is just a quick talk. Sorry if I wasn't getting there. Yeah, that's really it. This is Tech Shot Please.